also this morning, we are getting you organized just in time for spring. Design guy Brian Thompson is back to share easy ways to maximize your space. All that and much more straight ahead on this Thursday morning. Thank you for looking our way. It's time to get organized. We will show you how to declutter and maximize your space with style. And we're whistling this morning, just in time for spring cleaning. We are showing you how to get organized. Designer Brian Thompson has some tips to maximize your space. Yep. Well, good morning, Sandra. Good morning. It's good to be here. Um, you know, every time somebody calls you at the last minute to come over to your house, you're usually in a panic to get everything thrown away. I mean, I am. I oh, know yeah. To you. Throw it anywhere. Yeah. And so I've got some really great tips of how to be organized all the time and some things you can actually make yourself. So we'll just take you through some of these and show you them. Good deal. Okay. Um, a lot of things you can do with things that you already have. Um, this, you know, everybody has cords and PDAs and cell phones and, uh, and there are cords everywhere. Well, take something like a flower pot. It's got a hole in it already. You stick all your cords and your chargers down in there. And you got something fun and kitschy, and they all sit on top like a little, it's like a little hot, hot charger. Camouflage. Camouflage. I yeah. like this. Yeah, and I did it a couple different ways to show you can do it. You know, you can do it kitschy or you can do it with class, and mm -hmm. they both work. Use any sort of bowl. It's very easy. I hate looking at cords. Right. That's a great it's idea. Okay, and I also hate it when uh, people see all my bills on Everywhere. the counter there. Right, and yeah. um, you know what? One of the easiest things to do, sometimes these things are so easy, just grab a spring, mm -hmm. throw your little bills in there, and it's like a little file holder. Oh. I mean, it couldn't be easier. Where'd you get that from? I just got it at Home Depot. Good just deal. It's probably um, a nickel. <laughs> it's like a nickel, right? And they're organized. Um, a lot of times, it's just about using a, one I item as a different with a different function. Mm -hmm. um, and this is just a bird uh, feeder. Hang it in the bathroom, and it's like a bathroom caddy. So if you don't have a lot of bathroom uh, counter what space. What a cute idea. Right? And so, you know, you can do, you know, again. It's just... Deodorant, toothbrushes, whatever you have yeah, in there. Yeah, and I'm a boy, so that's about all I need. But you might have a, you can have two. Oh, three. it takes a village for me. Or I need a bigger birdhouse. Um, keys. Keys mm -hmm. everywhere. Grab an old picture frame and, uh, and a napkin. I cut it up. Um, fastened it to the back of that, screwed in some holes, and you got your in a little key rack. Look and at it's, that. Uh, nice just hang it in the choice. kitchen there. Yep. Um, this is actually just a shelf, and, I, and it's an old idea that I put an update on. Um, you take um, some really cool jars, screw the lids into the bottom of the shelf, and then the, the jars actually can hang from the bottom. So you make your shelves do double duty. Look at that. Yeah. You could put all kinds of stuff so in you, those jars. Yep. This is a very simple idea. If you've got gardening to do, pour some sand in a bucket, Fill it up with motor oil, and um, you just—it'll keep your tools fresh, and they won't—they won't rust during the winter months. And really, stuff. motor yep. oil motor keeps oil. them all. And it, and it keeps the sun moist and stuff, so it I doesn't. I didn't know that. A lot of times, you know, when you want to hang up pictures, um, it's you're putting all these nails in the walls and holes. The simplest thing to do is cut out pieces of paper the size of each picture, mm -hmm. put it on the wall, tape it up. Then when you put the picture up, you could just rip the paper off behind it, and you only have one nail hole in the wall. Voila. Voila. It's like an instant kit. You know how much spackle I've used over the years yeah. to fill in all the nail holes from exactly. the mess ups that I've done? Yep. And we have a, something at the front here, too. Yep. The last thing is um, this is great for small spaces. Mm -hmm. Call it an office in a box. Just get any old chest. Um, you can get them anywhere. And you fill in. You can put different boxes in it to put files. I put a bulletin board on the lid. And you got everything in one space. And, and then when the you best close thing the door, is you can close it. And it's gone. And nobody has to see. Right. Ryan, I like your tips. Lots of great ideas today. And there's your little favorite pooch. Yeah. All right. Knew we had to get him in. Yeah.